Hi, I'm Tara. I'm Dave. We're, We're the, the Thirsty, Thirsty Thrifters. Thrifters. Cheers. Cheers. I'm a part-time reseller on Poshmark and eBay. And I sell stuff on Facebook Marketplace and eBay. We make videos about reselling. And Amazon. I forgot. We don't that. make videos about Amazon. I sell on there. <laughs> Dave's um, all kinds on of stuff. a small time delay because he's recovering from being sick. We're going to do a haul video and David's going to be totally shocked. I haven't seen anything. By everything in here. This is a very tiny thrift store that I really like to go to. I like this store because it's packed full of clothes and it's usually not packed full of people. There were only a few other people in the store with me and my daughter that day and most of them were working there. It supports a homeless shelter so it actually is a non-for-profit, not-for-profit, non-profit, non not-for-profit. Those are the two words. Is it both? Yes. Wow. Just different ways to say it. I didn't so, go because it's the responsible thing to not go out in public. Oh, when, when you're sick. You're sick. So some of these things are for Dave to sell on eBay. Some of them are for my Poshmark closet. Most of them because I was the one there. My daughter got about twenty dollars worth of items. Mm -hmm. We spent total one hundred and sixty, but we got a lot. And a lot of things I'd never found before. So do you want to start? Sure. Okay, so Dave's going to be totally surprised by what this is. Some of it he won't even know what it is. This one actually I think is going to be better than I thought. Oh, wow, nice. Pink Carhartt. Pink Carhartt coat. It does have a... I wonder if it's women's. I'm just kidding. <laughs> one mark on the front I did see. Carhartt's not... You can see it there. So I have to wash this. Yeah, but but and what size was it? it because Large. It's a quality jacket. I looked these up and that's nice. Similar, like pink jackets. There's none available <coughs> right now on Poshmark, <coughs> and all the solds are fifty to a hundred dollars, and they charged me seven. So, do you think you can get that listed before I can? Because it needs to be up soon. Or do you want me to do it? You should probably do it if you want it fast. So this is Lucy. One of my favorite brands to wear, size large, leggings. These are not, you know, a huge dollar amount seller, but if I can't sell them, they're my size and I could wear them for, I just started doing yoga. So I could wear them if I can't sell them. Otherwise they'd probably be about $20 sale. What do you got? Oh, these are for Addison and my son. Adidas. He wants, he, all he wears is soft pants as we call them. And he doesn't want any more black because they show cat hair. He has cats at my house and his dad's house. I did not start doing yoga recently. So. I know that. Uh, these are a pair of Beta Brand, size medium. I have found Beta Brand or Beta Brand, how would you say it? Straight leg, I think. Straight leg. No, I mean, how would you say Beta Brand or Beta Brand? Beta brand. I've lost interest. I don't care what you think anymore. Um, cool. I found them like three times. Cool. <laughs> and the last pair I've, I purchased, I haven't sold. And the second Soma. pair sold for not much. We, we don't care either. Dave? Soma. Okay, this was a, probably, I shouldn't have purchased this because she charged me more than I expected. This was all on one hanger. What she's charging? This it was a, large. There were... It was all in one hanger, so I thought it was going to be one price. This is like a dress, kind of, or a nightgown. I'm not sure. Soma makes uh, sleepwear, but also clothing. But then there's a two-piece pajama set that is the exact same fabric that was on the same hanger. And she charged me like $4 per item, which was not cool. So I may have to just wear it. Soma's one of my favorite brands to wear because it's so comfortable. I'll show these. I got a lot of shoes because they charge... Four dollars per pair. I only have one of these. There it is. Okay. She's known for doing that too, buying one shoe. <laughs> I've only done that once. Uh, I saw somebody recently that bought. I some... think you've done that more than once, Tara. No. One, one time. time one time was head. on purpose, and one time was accident. I bought one teak on purpose. So wait, one and one equals. But you're saying how many? That's two, but one so was on purpose. <laughs> 
Answer the I question, I stick by ma'am. my answer. These answer the are question. Adidas, right? Size 7. I did figure out changing the when I got them home that they are they don't have the insoles, but that's not that huge a deal. Somebody can buy Dr. Scholl's insoles. But they're in really good shape, and I don't know how much this exact style is worth, but at least 25 or 30 I would say. What do you have now? More Soma, I bet, because there's two more Soma things. It looks just like the other. Just do them together. The so pants. here's the pants. Look, they're like sparkly, like... With they, ribbons. It looks like the sky at night, right? Yeah, it's a night nice sky pants. I really want to try them on. But I don't. Pants. I don't wear full pajama sets to sleep in. I don't know how people can sleep in that many clothes. Here. This is Soma also, and I've never seen anything like this. It's like a wrap. It's got a bunch of Soma. It's a wrap. There was a lot more. There was so much that I could have bought it's and made a profit bubbles. on, but I don't. No, it's a wrap. This it's looks like a sleeve huge. order. It's not a hole. It's a. Oh my gosh, Dave. I thought there was. I thought I saw a sleeve. And I was going for it. Uh, it's, it's, this is very soft. It's a one size wrap. We'll see how much that will sell for. I'm not sure. If wrap. I get ambitious, I'll put comps on the screen, but Ooh. odds are low. Okay. Damn. These are for Dave to sell because they're men's. And I Nikes. forget what size they are. And they're like. They have a little bit camo. of camo. 13s. I wear 13s. Dave's size. They may not get sold. So double. Th that's a double reason to buy because if. Might not get sold. If they don't sell, he can wear. I like Or those. mow the lawn in them. Those are cool. I'll do another pair of shoes here. These are Franco Sarto. I don't buy all Franco Sarto. Franco Sarto. But these were in really good shape. I feel like I And a cute him. style with the buckles. Just got to wipe off some dirt on the heel. You know a Franco? Just from his shoes. This is size 8. They are leather upper. They're the Casey style. I did actually get two. Oh, she does that sometimes too. Glad to hear. All right, what do you have next? More Nikes. More Nikes. These are like, what is that? Is it like an animal print kind of? Pretty teeny clean. tiny. Yeah, it's print. like it's like uh, olive drab. Olive drab? Yeah, olive drab is that color, right? Is that olive drab? Right. What is this word drab? I don't know. I just I that's what that it's called. Meant, like, ugly. It's like military. Oh, okay. It's a military color. I think these are size twelve. Okay. Am I correct? Yep. Yep. I, I Drab usually is an adjective for me, not a color. Lucky Brand. I, I don't know what you call this, but they will have a style name with a description online I can just copy. Like, Those it's not a booty. Is it a sandal? Booty? Peep toes? Boot, peep toe booty sandal? I, I don't know what you call it. Peep toe booty show. <laughs> They're size 10. I also got two. Of those, usually in the inside of most Lucky Brands, they will have a the size and the make, like leather, like what it's made of, and then the style name. This is orange. You'll know this one. St. John, are you kidding me? St. John's she, skirt. She goes crazy over St. John. I don't go crazy. Yeah, you do. I buy it because I know it will sell. Oh, you love St. John. I, I don't wear it, you but... I know the last that you time love I found, selling it. The last time I found St. John was at the, the Highway 127 highway yard sale. I sold all of those for like $100 each. So. Nice. I may send a few of the items I found to the Real Real so I don't have to put any effort into selling them. This will be another one that I might send to the Real Real. This was with another so, item from the same brand on the same hanger, but she charged me separately. What color is it? This is poop brown. I don't know. <laughs> I was looking for, oh, it is not. It's olive. a long cardigan. It's, yeah, it's I brown. believe it's wool. If I can find the tag. Viscose, nylon, angora, and cashmere. What was it made, Tara? Where? Yeah. I don't know. Well, this is Sandro. What language do you think they speak in wherever it's made? Well, English most or? of the people that buy it are here. Well. Size one. And I've had one Sandro sure. item before and I had to figure out what that one meant. I have another Sandra item in here and it's not size one, it's a normal size. So that was 
confusing. I'm gonna try to be a little bit more professional. Good we'll luck. See. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Good luck. Oh, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be a little bit more professional about this. More. Why did you buy this? I there were Victoria's a lot of Secret. I could have brought so many bras. They had so many Victoria's Secret bras. Thirty eight So double many Cassique bras. I checked before I said it. It's a thirty eight D. Or double, double D. Yeah, that's not going to fit me. Double D. Well, it's animal print and it's got some <laughs> it's not bling as, on it. It's not quite as big as the ones I said were the size of helmets. It's not. But this will probably be 15 maybe. I, I shouldn't have bought it. I could send it to flip. I'm sending a lot of things to flip. These are Vionic. Little oh. slip-on mules. Vionic's good, right? Vionic's good. First Ray Technology, whatever that means. I've never seen that. Bottom of the shoe looks uh, pretty good. Size 7.5. I have a lot of 7s and 7.5s I've listed lately in my closet. So I can make a really good deal. So I will look up the style name and figure out a better description. I look up style names by the numbers that I find. like, And this says it's a style name, Arbor. And then if I find the website where they describe the shoe, I copy that a whole description and put it in my listing because that gets all the keywords in my listing. I should start taking some of your advice. You should. Stuart Weitzman. Okay. What are these kind of called? They're... So Stuart Weitzman is a are these? designer brand. I do not usually buy Stuart Weitzman, but these is... are very similar to like Rothy's. That Rothies. are very popular right now, which is why I bought them. So they're stretchy, what they're knit, it? they're too big for me, I believe. Ten and a half, yeah. So I didn't look them up, but they were only four dollars. I'm sure I can get four dollars back. That's, probably probably that's, way more than four dollars. That's all we're really trying to do is no. just get our four dollars back. I'm sure I can get more, but that's the reasons <laughs> why I bought them for those. Those two things are going to help sell. Oh, I just found on my daughter's jewelry that she bought and didn't take out of the bag. Well, she needs more jewelry Daisy to necklace. lay around the house. So this place has like a jewelry cabinet, like a normal person's jewelry cabinet. And if you don't know it's there, oh. you wouldn't even know to look in it. All right, what do you have? Um, Anthropology. Size XL. Oh, it's an XL. I got it thinking if I can't sell it, I'll wear it. But that I don't me. really wear XLs. That fit me. It has a little chiffon hem. It's a waffle knit. Those are pretty consistent sellers. Waffle Ooh, knit. Sorry, I didn't mean tops. to hit you. Yes, you did mean to hit me. Oh, sure. Here's my other Sandro piece. This, so this is size 12, which is a normal size. This feels softer than the the wool cardigan, but it's like the same poop brown color. Oof. But I can just send this straight into the, the real real, and if if they don't take it. Oh, this is cashmere, 100% cashmere. Yeah, this, no this wonder is it's softer. Really soft. If it was a nicer color, man, I could just wear Ch that. Ch if it Chilla were nice soft. blue, but it's not. Uh, I can send that right into the real real, and if they don't take it, they send it back to you. Unlike thread up, I don't pay. You have to pay to get your stuff back, and I don't do that. Size? Dave doesn't know what this is because the tags cut out, but I knew what it was. Uh, Absolution. I don't. What's the brand? The brand is Democracy. These are my oh, personal the... bolo. Be on the lookout That's because I know they always sell. One hundred percent sell through rate on Absolution jeans from Democracy. Says I will pay eight. seven bucks for them at my thrift store because I know they'll sell. So that's, that's probably $20 to $25, and it'll be sold in a week. Dave, you can put this on eBay, okay? Sure. This is Ugly Old Lady Brand. She, why she give me Sorry, the old... Because Dave, it's an I'm eBay buy brand. some old, ugly stuff for you. I have sold this brand a jacket for $100 on eBay. And it's just ugly old lady stuff. Exclusively Masook. This one's extra small, so it may take a little longer, but uh, it's just like this. It feels like Santana knit, like St. John knit. It feels the same as Santana knit. I don't know. It's just like a, it just looks like St. John. I don't uh, remember what this was. 
Oh, oh 511 Tactical. These are almost 100% sell rate. Oh, yeah. They, I have 100% sell-through rate on that these brand. These are just like jeans. So these are like... These are women's. Cash Friday at the prison. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I think they're size Cash four. Cash Friday down at the police force. I think they're size four. The size four? That's little feller. This is a woman. Oh. So, I don't know who will sell these, but yeah, 511 Tactical, 100% sell through. I will buy it. I just for imagine. $4. That, I just imagine every pair of ta 511 Tactical has like 10 guns attached to it. Okay, I've got one of these. You must spray. have the other one. Huh? Oh, you must oh. have the other of my uh -oh. This is a lucky brand booty. I've sold this ex Words. I've sold this exact Words. style before with a zipper on each side. Oh, see ya. There's no way. Did I accidentally do this? This is a J. Jill boot. I accidentally grabbed a J. Jill and a Lucky Brand. So you know what that means. She went from two to four. You know what this means, though? In one day. You know what this means? What? We can go back there in a couple days, and I can take these and be like, uh, I got the wrong boot. Can I switch it? And we can shop some more. Okay. Well, what I intended to buy... What's this Lucky Brand booty, which is size seven, and what's the style name? Basil. You got I may one. have one of these for sale right now. I, I mean, I've sold these before. One-legged ladies out there. It's kind of funny how we were talking about that earlier, <laughs> huh? She's known for doing that, too, buying one shoe. <laughs> I've only done that once. Oh, goodness sakes. All right. I forget what this Oh, yeah. Vanessa, Virginia. It's hard to read. This is an anthropology brand. Cute top with elephants. Very batik style. Uh, the, the problem here is this is the size tag. Oh. And yeah, I can't figure out what that says. Even more faded than the... It says UK... Oh, it says UK 12 US 8. That's good. I can read it. In this bright light. So it's size 8. Made well. Made well 29. These are some high rise pants. Oh wow. They're just like a straight leg I believe. So I got them because I looked up the year on this little teeny teeny tag. And it's from 2018. So it's not very old. So probably 20 or 25 unless there's some sought after style. And what do you have next? It's like London oh, Fog. Yeah. It's not. J. Crew London Fog Edition. It's a J. Crew trench coat. I wow. just sold a J. Crew piece in under an hour, so that it's bodes well for this. It's um, kind of a cool tan. It's not like your average tan. Okay, Size it eight. is from 2016, and it has the style number in there. Good. Okay, I have two of these shoes. I think my daughter may wear these, but I, who knows? She, she was looking at them to buy, and I said, I'll buy them even if you don't want them. Because, you can see the logo. They, I can't even see the name. There's a fly, if that gives you a hint. They're Fly oh, London. London. Yeah, I, I knew that. You can kind of see it in there. Fly London. So I, I haven't said London I haven't fly. found this. <laughs> That would be wrong. I haven't found this brand in quite a while, but these are pretty cute, like a pinup style, burgundy, size 39. Burgundy? You don't think that's burgundy? Might be. What color would you call it? It's, it's almost got a little bit of a purple color to it. Maybe eggplant burgundy? Yeah. I don't know. It's almost. Maybe I can find the official color. Merlot. Merlot, oh my gosh, compare the two. Mm. They're pretty close. No. Okay, what do you Skin, have? Not pretty close. I know there's at least one more thing for you. It's big, too. It's got multi... Marmot. Multi-layers. What size? Large. It may be women's. I'm not I sure. I think it is. But it ha it's like a 
Wow. This Columbia is really Interchange. Nice. Yeah, and it's it has a good the inside part too. With the fleece. That's nice. So it was seven dollars for the whole thing. Oh man. I really I haven't checked any of these for money in the pockets, but you know, I can be hopeful. Yeah, you know these are nice when they got the vents. This one's zipped, the inside pocket zipped. Nothing in that one. Darn it. That's a consistent brand that I'll buy if it's in good shape. All right, this was just, I think somebody just put this back and told her she didn't want it. And then I saw it and I'm like, yeah, I'll buy that. Max Mara. This is a skirt. It is 100% camel hair. What? Yeah. Camel? It's like a... It feels, I mean, it seems like it has a little tulip. Well, they got long hair camels? In the back, you can kind of see a tulip seam. Kick, kick him? It's not a kick pleat. Kick who? Yeah. Made in Italy. Size USA 10. Man, I should just start wearing. Oh, it does have some little, let's see if you can see that. It's, it's like divots in the camel hair. I don't know what you call that. I didn't notice that, but that's all right. Not much. I may send that to I the real world. I can't make also. stuff with camel hair. Like, are they really that hairy? I've never met a camel. I'm not sure. Never met a camel either. Okay, I have two more items. They're very good items. So I have no items. It's all right. I'm just gonna hang out. This was first time I've ever found this brand. I will find the tag someday. Arata Silent Journey. I actually do not know where this is sold. I've heard of it many times. I don't know if it's an Anthro brand or something separate. I believe it's something separate. So it's a very, very long knit cardigan. Wow. Open front. It's, I'm probably not showing it at all. Looks like a blanket, basically. She asked me what it was. Sure. Oh, crap. What? I have a, I have a tag. One of those. I've never, I've never had it something with a, no, one time I think we did. Oh, I bet this I can is get a, it off. Let me see. Not, not right now. No, let me see. I just want to see how hard it's going to be. I will show you later. Oh, they're new with tags. Oh, there's a they're reason why they're stolen. So this is the first time I have ever found this brand. And they're Veronica hot. Veronica Beard. Right. Veronica Beard's hot. So the retail price on these Ali Gaucho jeans was two hundred and fifty dollars. Well, TJ Maxx. At TJ Maxx, says yeah, 59 they were. Ninety-nine. They were sixty clearance to thirty-six, and then nobody bought them. So they're wide leg jeans. We'll see. I hope. I mean, TJ Maxx could be a item that's oversaturated, like it went on yellow tag clearance, and a bunch of people bought it to resell. We will see. Worst case, I'll try them on. They're a little bit bigger than. Got it. <laughs> See, I've heard stories about the ink coming out of these tags. No, this is one of the item, ones that so makes the door beep. Dave got lucky. And, yeah, we don't have one of those in our house, so I don't have to worry about the door beeping all night. So that was, that was the end of the haul. Okay, so that's all we got. All right. Well, is, uh, is there anything else you want to say? Good stuff. How's the weather in your neck of the woods? It's cold here. It's not super fun. And there's no snow, so it's not even like fun. Snow's not fun. Snow's fun. I can throw snowballs. This has been the mildest and driest winter I've never, that I remember. It's because we we got a uh, a snowblower, so we won't have <laughs> we won't have any accumulation of snow for at least five years. And then we'll buy a new one. To keep that trend going. Yeah, maybe if we... No, in five years we'll move to the tropics. Or, I mean, I don't I don't want to live this... The tropics. I want to live somewhere where there's no snow. Yeah, that'd be nice. I want to live somewhere where the outdoor air doesn't hurt my skin. That will go with it. That'll work. All right, well, to the chickens. To the chickens. Good night. Hi, 
I'm Tara. I'm Dave. And We're we don't have the light on. What do I sleep in? Underwear. And that's it. People are going to think we're, our kids are freezing, like we don't feed them. We do. They feel safe sometimes. I don't think it's COVID because I never like lost my sense of smell or I didn't lose my sight or hearing. Your sight. Or Life with Dave is a fill in the blank. Olive drab. <laughs> Life with Dave is... Is an olive drab? Is a drab. Which I can't think of off one, one off head or anything. Off head? Off head. Yeah, off I'm a head. little messed up in the head. Last video, there was comment on it about... What? Okay. I'm not known for being professional.